Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can actually add images to your Teespring uh, listing or products, of course, on Teespring, as we said. So the first thing that you would like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow the tutorial steps. So here in my case, I'm actually using Brief. But of course, in your case, you can use any other browser. It could be possibly working for you. Once you do that, of course, make sure to go. And once you open your browser, make sure to go to the URL section. Simply type T Spring. Sorry, uh, Spring. Dot com and hit the enter button. Once you are here and left your first time, they will actually ask you to log in into your account. If you have an account, just go and log in into it. But if you don't, you will have to go and create your account and you find the option on the left of it. Of course, logging in or even uh, like creating your account can be made with uh, your Google account, with your Facebook account, or even with your YouTube account if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of creating or even logging in into your account. Once you do one of those, of course, you can just go into your account and create uh, your lesson as an example. Let's just go into create and let's just wait here until it loads. Of course, once you are here, as you can see, you will have a lot of options here. Make sure to go and click at start creating. Of course, as you can see, you can create like a lot of stuff. So let's say an example, we're going to uh, create a dad cap as an example. As you can see, they gave us caps. You can uh, look for shirts and any other stuff. So let's just for wait for everything until it loads. As you can see, it will not take a lot of time. And that is going to be our cap, of course. And you can actually add things on the back or even in the front. So, of course, as you said, we would like to add an image. So simply go to design here, click at choose a file and click at add image as an example. Then choose your image from here as an example. Like let's go into pictures and let's just as an example, we would like to add this. Let's just wait for it until it loads. And I'm coming back into you until it, once it's loaded. So as you can see here, once the picture is loaded, you'll find it here on the cap. You can actually minimize it or make it bigger. And of course, as you can see, the parts of your design for this layer outside the print. So make sure to make it all inside the cap and it will be here and the cap will be printed with your picture. You can just click at continue and publish an accessory. So this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching it. Goodbye.